Hi everyone and welcome back to Lighthouse Online. When we're growing up, we have to depend on the people who look after us, our parents or carers, to provide us with what we need. Things like love, food, clothing, things we need for school and times of fun. Sometimes we do not always get what we want and some children don't even get what they need. There is a story in the Bible that tells us of a time when people needed something really badly. They needed hope. They had come to Jesus for it, but they got a lot more than they ever expected. They got their lunch provided by God's goodness. Five loaves and a couple of fish, blessed by Jesus and shared. It was a bit of a miracle because not only was there enough for the thousands of men there, plus the women and children, but there was also leftovers. When we come to church, we come to hear about Jesus and hear the stories that give us hope. We not only find hope, but we also encounter so much more. The story of Jesus' miracle of feeding the five thousands helps us to understand that life is not about hoarding possessions, so keeping the things that we have and the belongings we have, but rather about sharing what we have and giving generously, sharing the leftovers, so to speak. Although giving to others can sometimes feel like we are losing something, it's that we realise that we gain a bigger blessing as we join with Jesus in bringing the miracles of hope to others. Be assured that we can depend on God who provides us with everything we need and even leave us with some leftovers to share with others. Let us end with a prayer and then I have an activity that you can do today. God, thank you for the story of hope. And we ask that you will help each one of us to remember your love for us and to help us share the hope we have in you with our friends and family. Amen. For today's activity, you're going to need a piece of paper, a pen, some sort of glue, and then you're going to need some coloured paper. You can either use coloured paper or you can colour in your own sheet of paper or you can use some recyclable papers that you have in your house. And what we're going to do is we're going to write hope in big letters on our piece of paper and fill in it with ripped up pieces of coloured paper. Mm -hmm.